Hi and welcome to another video. So this video it's just going to be a quick update I guess on projects and whatnot. So the last video was about uh, finishing the solar wiring for the shed and then it kind of got cold and I got busy with other projects. I put up my Christmas tree, I put up the Christmas lights. Next thing you know it's December and it's just too cold to do any kind of work outside. So as far as doing the rest of the stuff in the shed I think I'm done for this year. I want to do a cabinet for all the solar equipment instead of putting it on the ground and I want to build a box for the batteries to try to keep them warm. How did that get it there? I was looking for that. Yeah, so I kind of got sidetracked and I never ended up building those things and now it's just too cold to work. I mean, I might still do it. I might still put on a heater in the garage at some point if I get the wheel power and I might just build those two things. But that's kind of not the plan. I have a lot of indoor projects that I can be working on, a lot of other stuff, so I might do vlogs on those things. But I kind of got the realization that promising one video per week is probably much, especially for somebody like me who's just kind of a part-timer and not doing this full-time. So instead of promising a video per week, I'm going to aim you know, to try and make a video as often as I can, but trying to keep up to a certain schedule, it's, it's kind of hard. So anyway, some other projects I have lined up is, well, the first one was a shed. I mean, that, that's been ongoing. But the, the main reason I built the shed is so that I can finish the garage. Now, the garage is where all the other projects are going to come from. Once I have a proper garage that's insulated, heated, and that I can actually work in all year round, I'll be able to do all sorts of projects. I'd like to get into like RC cars, drones, that kind of stuff, electronic projects, woodworking projects. Who knows, right? Like once I have an actual workshop to work in, well, the possibilities are endless. So that's that's the plan. So the next project is definitely the garage. But again, it's kind of cold to do that during the winter. So I don't think I'll do it in winter, but we'll see. I do have a propane heater I can kind of set up and work at it a bit during winter. The first step is going to be removing the chimney. Now there used to be an old wood burning fireplace in this house. It's capped, so it's never been used since I've lived here. And those wood burning fireplaces are actually really inefficient, so I didn't want to bother. Now, originally I was thinking of putting a wood burning insert, and that would be nice. I mean, the new wood stoves are actually really efficient, especially if you add an intake to get combustion air from outside. The problem with the old style fireplaces is they use the inside air for combustion, so you're sucking up all your warm air from inside, outside through the chimney. In a way, the fireplace might actually cool down the house. It's going to be very warm and close to the fireplace, but anywhere else in the house is going to be freezing. So anyway, I decided against that just because the fireplace is actually in a bad spot. My whole living room layout is just terrible. But I like to actually do is put the couch in front of the TV. You know, where it actually belongs. But my current setup doesn't allow me for that. I've tried all sorts of configurations, it just doesn't work. So anyway, so the chimney is going to have to come out. And then after that, I'll be able to take out the fireplace. I have to do the chimney first because the chimney actually sits on top of the brickwork for the fireplace. So, some of it is actually structural to some extent, so I'll have to be careful of that. But anyway, so I might do that this winter, we'll see, I'm not sure. The next project is to finish insulating the basement. I did the basement part, and I haven't started on the crawl space. Right now, it's already warmer in my basement than it is upstairs, because the upstairs is badly insulated. In fact, when I got my patio door redone, I kind of took apart part of that wall, so I can kind of redo it. And the vapor barrier wasn't even taped. There was even spots missing insulation. It was actually pretty terrible. I would actually get frost on the drywall. Yeah, that's how bad it was. So anyway, so those are some things to maybe expect in the future. So winter is probably going to be slower in terms of vlogs, but I'm going to try to do some videos of maybe drone flights or whatever. Anything I can try to do to at least have something to upload. That's kind of my goal with this channel. I don't really have any specific subject. I just kind of want to upload random stuff and now one thing I'd like to do is explain how the solar system in the shed works because I never really explained that in my vlogs when I showed the progress. It was just kind of a footage or whatever, time lapse. It doesn't really show much as far as how it works. So in the future I might make a video on that. But yeah, so this is it for today. Uh, this video was just really an update pretty much because originally I think I had promised that I want to do a video per week. And then I just kind of realized it's not really realistic for me at this point. Until I get to the point where I have a proper shop to work in, where I can actually make videos inside the shop while I'm work, it's kind of pointless. So I'm, I'm actually looking forward to this. Believe it or not, I've been wanting to build this garage for a long time. It's too small to park a car in, so I'm not even going to bother using it for that. So I may as well make it into a nice 
woodworking shop or whatever and I can do all sorts of projects. As a totally side note, uh, as you can see I have a pretty thick beard now. I've been growing it for about three months. I've only started growing a beard maybe like three, four years ago. I've always been clean shaven, like I wouldn't, I wouldn't even go a day without shaving. And then one day I just decided I should maybe try growing a beard and see how it looks like. And I kind of like how it looks like. It's very thick and red and it's kind of cool. And I also decided to start growing my hair out. It's been maybe since around, I don't know, six, seven months is my last haircut. It's getting pretty long. I figure I'm getting older now and I may as well take advantage of still having hair. I mean, hopefully I don't lose it anytime soon, but you never know. So I may as well take advantage of it. Is it ever getting long? Like, I think I even have a little bit of receding going on, but I never really kept track, so I don't know how long it's actually been that way. So I'm probably fine for a while, I think. I mean, there's a little bit of thinning, but I think I'm okay. But yeah, so I figured I may as well grow it long and see how it turns out. So yeah, so that's pretty much it for this video. Bye!